Ah, oh, what another great sleep. I put it there here and you're ready for an adventure. Let's go check if little Cardi's away. You can see what we're gonna do today. Uh, do, 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 do. Come on, buttons. Oh, he's coming. Okay, uh, little Cardi. Oh no, there's Brian though. Hey, Brian. Uh, where is little Cardi gone? She's not in the swimming pool. Oh, uh, I guess she might be already out running errands or something, but I guess we should go downstairs and get some breakfast. I'm kinda in the mood for some pancakes, maybe. Hmm, that would be delicious. Okay, let's go down and see what's going on. Um, wow, okay, Chef Marty's shelves are pretty empty. Hey, Chef Marty, what's going on? Hey, little Kelly, I'm out of eggs and milk. Could you get some for me? Sure, Chef Marty, no problem. Uh, I'm gonna need some buckets for the milk. Let me see if there's any back here. Buttons, get off the counter. That's where Chef Marty cooks his food. Okay, here's some buckets. Awesome, okay. Uh, let's head outside. Come on, Buttons, it's time to go to Daisy and collect some milk. And we need to get some eggs from the new chicken coop too. So let's head out this way. Okay, oh, wow, it's such a lovely day. And look at all those lovely flowers. Let me go and take a smell. Ah, lovely. I love the smell of fresh flowers on a sunny day. Okay, so we need to go and look at all these flowers too. That's awesome. Um, we need to go and get the milk and eggs for Chef Marty. I wonder where little Carly is today though. I haven't seen her in so long. Okay, uh, let's see. We don't need the garden shed. We just need... Oh, there's a chicken coop. Okay, is there any eggs though? Um, any eggs? Hello? No eggs? Okay, maybe in a few minutes I'll go to Daisy first and see if there's any... Oh, whoa, okay. I forgot about this new pipe here. Okay, there we go. Uh, so where is Daisy? I think she's through here, maybe? Let's have a look. Daisy, where are you? Daisy? Is she gone wandering off again? I think she might have. Daisy, where are you? Uh, let's have a look. Nope. Where are you, Daisy? Oh, we're all the way at the back of the beginning. I wonder if Daisy's been moved. Um, maybe we should go check the village and see if Daisy's out there. Because I know she likes to go wandering around through the kingdom sometimes. So let's go check there. Come on, Buttons, you have to help me sniff Daisy out. We need to find her. I wonder if she's having fun. Let's have a look around. Oh, Daisy, where have you been? Oh, don't you moo at me like that. You are not at your little stable. That's where you're meant to be. I was coming to get milk from you. Let me just grab it here. But I suppose you're all safe here in the kingdom and Buttons will stay with you. Actually, let's bring you back. I've got Buttons lead with me, so this will work on you. Come on, Daisy, let's go. We'll bring you back and we can maybe put you in the chicken coop with the rest of the chickens because I don't know where the stable girl has moved your stable. Come on. Where? Come on. You coming? Let's go. Come on. Daisy. Where'd your lead go? Did it fall off? Okay, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Where did the lead go? Do, 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 do. Let's see. Come on, Daisy. Okay, you can stay there and eat the flowers. I've got the milk anyway, and I'll come back and get you later. But let's go check the chicken coop for some more eggs, because Chef Marty needs eggs and milk. Maybe he can make me some pancakes out of it. That would be pretty awesome. But let's go have a look. Um... Okay, so the chicken coop was this way. I wonder if the chicken have laid any eggs. They seem like they were a little bit, maybe they hadn't laid any this morning when I got there, but let's go check now. Okay, we're nearly there, Buttons, come on. He's such a slow mover because he's so small. Oh, the chicken have laid some eggs. Let's go in and get them. Okay, uh, some there. Come on, Buttons, you get out of here before you scare the chickens. Buttons, oh no, chicken's loose. Chicken on the loose, quick, get back in. Okay, uh, Buttons, you're gonna have to leave. There we go, okay. Uh, we've got one chicken on the loose. Get back in there. Come on. Back in your little pen. Nope, don't run around. Come on. Urgh. Chicken on the loose. Chicken on the loose. Okay. Nope. Okay. Sorry. I don't mean to hurt you, chicken. You just need to get back in. Come on. Stop, stop. Stop moving. You're so fast. How are you so fast? Okay. Oh, no. Oh, goodness. I killed a chicken. I'm sure Chef Marty won't be upset, though, because I could give him some of this rock chicken to cook for lunch. So let's go back in and give him all this stuff here. And then I guess maybe little Carly will back, be back from her errands and we can go on an adventure maybe. Because I haven't seen her in so long and I miss her. But anyway, come on Buttons, are you following? Yeah, good boy. Okay, let's go inside here and give this all to Chef Marty. And we can put it on the shelves and then we can see if little Carly's around. Okay, 
So, do 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 do. There we go. Chef Marty, I got all the things that you asked for. Milk and some eggs. It was pretty difficult to get the chickens to stay in their coop while I got their eggs, but it's all there now. Anyway, I'm gonna go see if little Carly's home, okay? Oh, I forgot I got this raw chicken as well. I accidentally killed one of the chickens trying to get it back in the coop. But there you go. You can maybe cook that up for some lunch for yourself. That'd be nice. But come on, Buttons, let's go see if little Carly's around. Oh, I wonder who this is. Uh, hello there. Who are you? Oh, goodness. Has it been so long that you can't remember your dear old cousin, Princess Millie? I mean, we played as children together the whole time. Oh my gosh, Millie, it's been forever. You're all grown up now, just like me, but... Oh my gosh, you look amazing. Look at you. But what are you doing here? It's been so long. Well, I just came for a visit, but I also have a bit of news for you, little Kelly. I think you're going to be excited. Oh, well, do tell, Millie. Oh my gosh, it's been forever. I'm so excited. What's your news? Are you going to college? What's going to happen? Well, guess what? I'm getting married! I found the guy of my dreams. He's so great. His name's Alexander. He's from a different kingdom. He's so cool. But I think you're really, really gonna like him. But the wedding is super soon. It's in like two days. But that's why I wanted to ask you, will you be my maid of honor? Oh my gosh, Millie, of course I'll be your maid of honor. This is gonna be amazing. Oh boy, I can't believe you even asked me. It's been so long, but we were best friends growing up. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, we have to go tell little Carly that the wedding's happening. Come on, I'll show you around. Uh, yeah, I'm all about meeting your friends, but uh, who is this little Carly person? What? Your parents never told you? I can't believe my uncle and aunt would be so silly. Well, basically, I had a long-lost sister and her name is Little Carly and now we're best friends and we go on adventures together. It's so much fun. Her bedroom is just upstairs right there and mine is over there, but let me show you around downstairs first. What? You've got a sister? How come no one tells me anything in this family? That's crazy. Oh my goodness, of course I want to go meet her. Let's go. Okay, Princess Millie, let's go then. So over here is uh, the kitchen, and this is Chef Marty. So the Chef Marty, this is my cousin, Princess Millie. I hope it's nice that you meet each other. So let's go this way then. We've got the dining room over here. So that's where um, my mom and dad have their throne. And oh, this is my dog, Buttons, by the way. Uh, he's super cute. And then over here, we've got the dining room, because this castle has totally changed since you were here. So that's our butler, Dean, over there. It's pretty cool. So so let me show you upstairs now. It's going to be so awesome. Okay, I wonder if little Carly's home. I really hope so. This is such big news. Come on, guys. Uh, so these are all our security guards. We've got a few of them around. They just look after us. Millie. Oh, there you are. Okay, and then here we have my bedroom. So if you could walk inside here, I've got a little beach area. I've got a little flower garden that my boyfriend got me. I've got like a, a love heart rug. We've got buttons bed. Oh, we've got so much stuff in here. And then across the way over here is little Carly's room. So follow me across this bridge. It's really cool. We built this so we could like get to each other's bedrooms super quick and stuff. So little Carly. No, she's still not home. This is her dog, Brian, though. He's so cool. He's just like buttons. And she's got like a swimming pool out here. And she's got her keyboard that she plays. And yeah, I don't know where she is though. But uh, what do you want to do with your day? Uh, well, I kind of forgot to mention. I have an appointment in a dressmaker's for the two of us to go get dresses made for the wedding. But um, if you want to wait for your sister, I guess we could do that too. Oh my gosh, we're gonna go wedding dress shopping? That sounds like so much fun. Oh, maybe we could get some shoes too. Um, okay, well, I don't want to miss our appointment, so let me just give little Carly a call here. So, um, I'll just punch in the numbers. And, oh, it's ringing, it's ringing. Let me just see. Hmm. Weird. She usually picks up pretty soon. Oh, there's no answer. Okay, well, I guess we can't miss the appointment. We can meet little Carly later. But uh, let's go now and go to the appointment. Let's go. Come on, Millie. Wow, I've never been in this city before, Millie. It looks pretty cool. Uh, you said that the dress shop was this way in the square? Wow, it looks awesome. Look at all these market stalls. Okay, let's have a look around. I guess we have some time before the appointment. So we got some melons on this stall. We got what we got over here. Nothing much in that one. 
for look books and books upon books look at all of this place wow it looks so good i wonder if there's what's in here oh no nothing uh let's see what else we got oh, flowers oh my goodness millie look oh, do you have any idea what flowers you're gonna wear for the wedding um i'm thinking red because it's my favorite color but let's just continue having a look around Ooh, red is a nice choice midi but yeah let's keep on going i guess we have to get to this dress shop so come on uh let's have a look we've got some mushrooms here maybe they're for dinner or something oh look artwork wow got some signs and stuff here <gasps> cake oh my goodness a cake i'm sure you've got a delicious cake made for you already right oh of course and of course it's my favorite chocolate oh my gosh and chocolate is my favorite too that is so cool oh i think i can see the bridal store over here look there's so many cafes and so many people around it's awesome so come on let's go have a look in here and see if we're on time for the appointment yet yeah, the white and pink shop that's what it was right okay let's go in here um hello my name is little kelly and this is my cousin millie and she's getting married in a couple of days and she made an appointment Oh, hello, darlings. Yes, of course. Uh, Millie, we've got the dress you ordered in the back there. And little Kelly, we've got some of these sample choices that your cousin picked out for you. What? Millie, you already picked a dress. I thought we were shopping together. But oh my goodness. Okay, if you've got some choices that you'd like me to wear, of course I'll try them on. But uh, let's get you a seat somewhere and then I'll put on a little fashion show for you. Okay, Millie, now that you've got a seat, I'm going to go try on some of the options that you made for me. Uh, okay, uh, let's have some fun with this and take some of the stuff that she wouldn't be expecting. Okay, let's take all this stuff and add uh, these shoes too. Okay, okay, let's go in here and pretend like we're getting changed. Okay, oh my gosh, we're going to look awesome. Okay, let's check it out, let's check it out. Oh, uh, she's going to think this is so funny that I'm wearing a tux. Okay, let's walk down are you ready do do okay and yeah <laughs> here millie here's your first choice what do you think <laughs> oh little kelly i can see you're still the joker you wear when you were a kid but uh seriously the tuxedo is not happening at my wedding we gotta hurry up we gotta make it to the shoe store before it closes after go try on some of the options oh okay party pooper let's go take all this stuff back i thought it was kind of nice and it might go with the wedding a little a bit oh gosh okay let's put this down here uh the shirt the pads and the shoes and they were white i mean that's really bridal isn't it i thought it was anyways okay uh let me see where are these dresses let's go try another one on Hmm, I like it. She chose one of my favorite colors anyway. Pink is there, but let's go show it off to her and strut down the runway. Okay, here we go. Do 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 do. Well, my, Millie, what do you think? Would you like to have this at your wedding? Me to wear this as my maid of honor's dress? I mean, I like it, but I'm not sure about the stripes. Yeah, I was totally just thinking the same thing. Why don't you go back inside and try another one on? whatever you want mrs bride to be oh my goodness it's so exciting okay let me try on the next one and see how it looks wow that's so more like it it's like, like pink i love it okay let's go show millie the dress okay here i come millie are you ready for your next option check this one out i love it it's pink my favorite color and it's light pink and i think it's really pretty what do you think well it's definitely a contender but i just have one more special dress that i thought you could wear i was thinking since we were such good friends as kids why don't we wear the same color on my wedding day it'd be such a cool best friend thing to do so there's one white dress i want to try on but if you don't like it you can pick this one then I don't know, Millie. I think wearing white might be a little bit weird, but if you want me to try it on, I will. Okay, so a white dress on Millie's wedding day. Can I really do that? I mean, it's a bride's big day, but if she wants it, she gets what she wants. Anyway, let me try it on and see if it fits. Wow, it's so pretty, but I wonder if 
Millie will like it. Okay, Millie, here is the white dress option. What do you think? I think it's really, really cute. But at the end of the day, it's up to you whether I wear white or not. Or the pink dress. It really is all down to you, Millie. Oh, little Callie, this white dress is perfect perfect on you. I definitely think you should wear it as being my maid of honor. We can both wear white and the day can be special for both of us because we're reunited after so long. But I think we found the dress, so let's see if we can order it now. Okay, I'll go ask the girl. Um, My cousin was wondering if I could order this dress that I have on right here, this lovely white one uh, for a wedding that's in two days. Uh, Millie, where will I get it delivered to? Where's the wedding on? Oh, I probably should have mentioned that as well. I picked a chapel right by your castle, so I was thinking I could stay there the night before the wedding, and so could my uh, husband-to-be, but he'd be in a separate room. Um, so, yeah, if we could get it delivered to the castle, that'd be great. Wow, Millie, how could you forget that you were getting married right by my castle? That is so cool. Okay, uh, so yeah, miss, I needed to be delivered to the castle in Magical Kingdom, if that's okay, uh, by tomorrow, I guess, or tomorrow, today, mm, tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. I guess the wedding morning would be okay, too. But uh, so now we've picked the dress, and I think I look fabulous. It's time to put this one back and go shoe shopping. Are you ready, Millie? Let's go! Aw, oh, thanks for waiting for me to get changed out of that dress. Okay, let's find this shoe store, okay? Um, let's walk along here, maybe. Uh, okay, that's got a really cool cafe. I wonder if we could grab a bite to eat before we get home. That would be cool. Uh, let's see, where is this shoe store? Is it up there? I know it's meant to be in the square somewhere. Um, shoe store, where are you? Oh, there's a restaurant in there. Uh, let me see, is it in here? Ah, oh, the shoe store. Awesome, come on, Millie, it's in here. Oh, oh, hello there, miss. Um, we're looking for some wedding shoes. Is it okay if we try some on? Totally, and we have this special offer where if you buy today, we can actually deliver. Oh, that's awesome. So that way, Millie, we can get them delivered to the castle safe and sound. So what kind of shoes were you looking at? Because there's some boots here. Let's see. Let me try these on. Uh, let me see how these look. Uh, I'm not too sure about these for your wedding day. Uh, let me put them back here. Okay. What else have we got? Maybe um, let's have a look. Ooh, what's over here? Oh, look at these ones. Well, these black ones, Millie, what about these ones? They look nice. Um, I don't know. What were you thinking, Millie, anyway? What color would you like? Um, maybe red ones because I'm going to have red flowers and red is my favorite color. Okay, red ones, red ones. Let me have a look around. Okay, what are these ones? Ruby slippers. Let me see what they look like. Well, these ones look nice. Maybe these ones. Ruby slippers might be cool on your wedding day. Or let me see what else we got. Uh, any other red ones? Ooh, we got more shoes there. Oh, perfect. Red high heels. What about these ones, Millie? They are perfect. Oh, I wonder if they have my size. Have they got a size five? Um, let me just check. Uh, let me see. So these ones are three. Uh, there are three. Um, okay. Let's put them back. And um, let me see. Are any of these? Oh, there's a size five. Awesome. Okay. So um, yeah, they have a size five. So I'll just get them delivered. Uh, hello, miss. Uh, can you get these delivered to the castle in the magical kingdom in the next day or to the day after tomorrow's morning? Because it's her wedding and she's gonna wear them underneath her dress so no one can see the red because she's gonna be wearing white it's gonna be awesome thank you so much for your help okay millie i think we're good to go oh my goodness this is awesome thank you so much for helping me today little kelly i was thinking i could come stay in the castle tonight as well if that's okay yeah of course you can millie that would be so so great and then the day after tomorrow is the wedding so we'll have a sleepover today and tomorrow and then the wedding will be happening and your dress and shoes will be delivered and my dress too it's gonna be awesome okay well let's get out of here and get home and you can meet little carly so let's go see if she's home yet Ah, oh, I'm all showered and fresh and it's the night before the wedding. I better go check on Millie. The last I checked, she was watching a movie. 
Oh yeah, it was such a good idea, Millie, to move a couch and a TV in here to get rid of your cold feet before the wedding. I know you have a little bit of nerves, but that is okay. Buttons is gonna be here too to look after you. But I'm still just gonna run across because little Cardi didn't come home last night. I'm gonna go check if she's there again. And um, actually, you know what? Maybe I'll go get down and get some candy first. Let's go check the kitchen for candy buttons. Come on, is he coming? Buttons. I don't think he's coming. I think he likes Millie more than me. Okay, well, let's see if there's any candy around because I'm starving. I know Millie is starving too and she likes to eat when she's nervous and she definitely loves some cookies. But no! Chef Marty, what is going on here? There's no, no food anywhere to be seen and this is the night before the wedding. You haven't even used the stuff I got you yesterday. That's crazy. Or the day before yesterday. Okay, uh, where else can I get some candy? Hmm... Oh, I know little Cardi has a stash in her room. Maybe we can go and raid that and then we'll replace it before she gets home. Hopefully she's back in the morning for the wedding, but it's going to be hard to tell. Okay, let me see. Uh, where would she keep her candy? Nope, that's just a bed. Uh, pickaxe. Maybe over here. Some teddies and dolls and stuff. She wouldn't leave it outside. Oh, what about this chest in here? Nope. Okay, well, ooh, there's only one more chest. So let's see. <gasps> There we have it, two lollipops, chewing gum, cake, cookies, and sweets. Yum e. Okay, so let's go and bring these to Millie so she can have a little bite to eat before the wedding. I suppose we should ask her if she's okay and she's nervous and stuff. So Millie, uh, here's a cookie. I know you were asking for a cookie. Um, how are you feeling? Um, I'm pretty nervous, but I'm pretty excited too. I just can't wait to see Alexander and marry him once and for all. He's staying, uh, I think down in the library of the castle, which is pretty funny. But, um, I just can't wait for everything to be delivered in the morning so I can relax and enjoy the wedding day. Well, don't worry about it, Millie. You just try and get a good night's sleep in bed and uh, we'll wake up in the morning and we'll have time for the wedding. I'm so excited. I'll go check in the morning for the deliveries so we have to make sure the dress is there and all that stuff and it's going to be super exciting. But now I think it's time that we get some beauty sleep because we want to look amazing tomorrow and you got a shower in the morning as well. So uh, let's get to bed. Oh, Millie, Millie, where are you? Millie, oh no, she fell asleep on the floor in front of the TV. <gasps> Look, the TV is still on. Okay, uh, I better not wake her. She still has a little while before she has to get ready. So I'm gonna go down and check the deliveries and see if our dresses have arrived. I'm so excited. Okay, whoa, now I can be loud. Yeah, I'm so excited. Today is the day, oh my goodness. Okay, so we need to check that the dresses have arrived. So let me go check the post box outside and make sure they're there. Woohoo! Millie! Princess Millie! You're awake! Oh, hey, cuz! Um, the dress has arrived. Your one is in the bathroom hanging up, ready to be put on. So you go do that now and get showered and get ready and stuff. I'm gonna go get some flowers ready for your bouquet and then I'm gonna come up and get changed. So you go get changed now. I'm gonna go get the bouquet of flowers. Okay, so I'm not gonna take any from this garden because, you know, well, Kind of the garden that Donnie got me, so I wouldn't feel right ruining it and picking flowers. But I know there's some red flowers around outside in the kingdom. So let's go get some red flowers together for Millie to hold while she's walking down the aisle in her white dress. And it's going to look amazing. Okay, so not them ones. They're too big. Okay, we want the small. Well, maybe let's, maybe let's pick one of these and we'll let her pick. Okay, let's see. Oh, they look lovely. Okay, maybe them ones. And let's give her a choice. So let's see what else we got. Have we got any red flowers around here? Oh, yeah, we do. Okay, we've got some poppies, is it? Let's see. Uh, yeah, we got... So let me see what looks better. Okay, so either that one or that one. Oh, I think the rose bush looks awesome. Okay, cool. So let's bring it back up to Millie and hopefully she'll be changed by now. So she should be in her wedding dress and we have the bouquet of flowers and that's everything that we need to have a great day. So let's run all the way back upstairs. Okay, let's do it. Millie, Millie, I found the perfect bouquet for you. Oh, wow. You look breathtaking. You're like the most pretty bride I have ever seen, Millie. Oh my goodness. Alexander is going to be blown away. Okay, will you take that? And I'm going to go get changed now. Okay, let me see my dresses in here too. So let's get changed. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. 
<gasps> okay, I'm all ready to go, and I think I look great. So now it's time to go see Millie all finished and ready. Okay, uh, let's see if she's here. Oh, and she's got her bouquet. Millie, you look awesome, and we're finally ready to go. So um, what do we do next? Little Kelly, the shoes, the shoes never arrived. What are we gonna do? Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous now. Oh, the shoes aren't here. Don't you worry about it, Millie. I'll run back into the city and get the shoes. There will be enough time. You wait here, okay? Um, I better, oh gosh, what am I gonna do? Okay, I better go talk to Alexander and tell him to try and delay the wedding because I need to get into the city and get these shoes before we have to go to the wedding. Her wedding will be ruined if she goes barefoot. Okay, let's see, uh, Alexander, Alexander, um, Oh, well, hi, Alexander, you look great, you're all ready, and you've got red buttons and a red thing. Oh, um, uh, uh, yeah, I'm Little Kelly, by the way. It is so good to finally meet you, Little Kelly. My name is Alexander from the Kingdom of Laurel. Oh, yeah, hi, Alexander from the Kingdom of Laurel. I mean, I knew your name already, but, uh, I didn't expect you to be so, well, um formal but anyway i've got some bad news uh millie's shoes never arrived and i'm gonna need to go back into the city to get them before the wedding starts so i'm gonna need you to try and delay the wedding as much as possible keep everyone entertained in the church and the chapel and i'll be back as soon as i can but i really gotta run so uh yeah will you be able to do that oh no okay i'll try to delay the wedding as long as i can until you get back with millie's shoes good luck Thanks, Alexander. I gotta go. Okay, little Kelly, this is your mission. You have to save Millie and Alexander's great day. Um, I always talk to myself in third person when I'm nervous. Oh, no. Oh, Buttons, what were you doing outside? Okay, it's time. We gotta go. We gotta get to the city and get these shoes before the day is ruined. This is crazy. This is ludicrous. I'm running around a town in a bridesmaid's dress. I really need to get these shoes, though. I'll be the best maid of honor ever if I do. Okay, so where was the shoes shop again? Um... Excuse me, okay, um, sorry, uh, excuse me, miss, excuse me, oh, 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 the shoe shop, oh, awesome, okay, okay, uh, let's quickly go and grab a share pair of shoes, okay, I need, uh, a size five, uh, okay, perfect, size five, I'll pay double, uh, tomorrow, I just need these right now, bye, okay, okay, now it's time to get back to the wedding, oh, no, I think I'm running out of time, what if, what if she goes down the aisle in her bare feet, it'll be the worst thing ever, okay, I gotta get back to the kingdom. Hang on, hang on! Don't start the wedding, I'm on my way! Oh, thank goodness, Millie, you're still here. Oh, look, okay, you've got your roses. Here, I got your shoes. I'm so sorry I'm late. Is everyone inside? Oh, gosh, yeah, they're all inside. It's so packed in there. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm so nervous. I thank goodness you're here, and thank goodness you bought the shoes. It made me feel so much better, but I mean, there's so many people, and they're all gonna be watching me, and I don't think I can do this. I mean, it's gonna be totally crazy. What if I trip? What if I fall? What if Alexander says no? Oh, I don't know what to do. Okay, Millie, I'm gonna need you to relax. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Okay, calm down. This is your big day. It's your wedding day and you love Alexander. You know you do. You said he was your dream guy and when I met him, he seemed prim and proper and that was always the type of guy that you wanted to marry and he's from the kingdom of the Rel. You know that's one of the most amazing kingdoms ever and one day you will be queen but the most important thing is that you love him and it's just about you and him. So when you're walking down the aisle, just look at him, relax, take deep breaths. I'll be at the top of the aisle waiting for you to get up there, okay? You just need to relax and breathe. Remember, you're in love. This is meant to be the happiest day of your life. You're so right, little Callie. I can't believe I was even thinking that way. How could I walk away from Alexander? He's the best thing that ever happened to me. But you're right. You head in there and tell them that I'm ready to come in and start the ceremony. Oh, I'm so excited now. Okay, Millie, I'm gonna go in now. You get yourself ready. Okay, I'm gonna close this so it's a big surprise. Okay, guys, uh, sorry about the delay. Uh, my name is Little Kelly. I am the bride's maid of honor. So great for you all to make it and be so patient. I really appreciate it, and so does Millie and Alexander. But I just gotta talk to Alexander now, okay? Uh, Alexander, um, she's all good to go. I think we can start the music. I think she's ready to walk down the aisle. Okay, I'm gonna go stand in my place just here. And uh, I have my flower. Okay, I'm ready. I'm 
now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss the bride. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Minecraft Wedding, where my cousin Millie got married. Little Curly was a while missing, guys. If you know where she is, let me know. But oh my gosh, it was so much fun. We had a bit of a disaster this morning because we couldn't find the shoes, but we got everything sorted in the end. And Millie is now married to Alexander, guys. If you enjoyed this episode and you'd like to see another Minecraft wedding, hmm, I wonder who we could be talking about. Please leave a like and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Don't forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter for uh, sneaky peek updates and real life stuff too. But until next time, you guys, see you again soon.